Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or good night, depending on where you are at and what time you are watching this in the future. Um, got some new scenes here for starting and be right back and ending the stream and my game stream. And you can thank, uh, okay, good night. <laughs> Thanks, Shadow. <laughs> you love the starting scene screen? I love it too. Um, all of these were made by the lovely Kitty Chaos, um, and if you want, let me go ahead and switch, let me show you here, here's the Be Right Back screen, got a lovely waterfall, some sparkles, we've got the stream ending background, and some deer and our game screen which I have added in most recent subscriber hopefully it works um, we'll see how that goes we we're fiddling around with it before the start of the stream which is why we we're a little late so hopefully it works we'll see um, and I have an alert for whenever somebody uh, subscribes so we'll see if all of it's working properly today. If it's not, we'll just have to do some tweaking in the future. But yeah, if you want to support Kitty Chaos, uh, let me see here. Um, I'm going to link her shop in the chat where she makes um, Twitch and YouTube uh, layouts like the one that I'm showing you right now so there's that for the future if anybody wants to check out her stuff all very cheap and they're all very lovely so and subscribes and resubscribes to hear the notification <laughs> see if it does it or not I don't know if it will or not but We'll see. But yeah, so try it out. Well, it's not a new game for me, but it's a new game for the the web uh, the channel. God, I can't talk today. I'm still sick, guys. I'm trying to work through it. I'm like dying of heat right now. But yeah, we're playing Let's Build a Zoo, which is a cute little game um, with a twist. You can trade for other animals from different zoos but you can also create hybrids it says there's over 300,000 combinations of hybrids that you can make so you can see like the little elephant in the sky that's elephant hawk <laughs> so yeah nothing happened i'm sorry let me did it say anything about it in here no maybe since you're already subscribed i don't know because it didn't show it in the Streamlabs. I can show you what the alert is though. Let me see here. Alert box. I can do a test, I think, right now. Did it work? Should have shown up. 
I did a test alert. Hmm. I don't know. Well, maybe that's something I'll have to look at. It was working when I started the stream, or before I started the stream. working. I'll have to figure that one out later. But yeah, it's all new stuff. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything either. I'm not, there's supposed to be a sound notification too, so. I don't know why it's not working now all of a sudden. isn't showing for some reason. Maybe it's because I'm on a different one. Log out. Log in. Log in with YouTube. Let me try this. No, I don't want widgets. I want the alert box. There it goes. I was on the wrong account. Should work now. Hopefully. <laughs> yeah, I got a kitty following in the box. But yeah, let's go ahead and get started on the game. Um, see how long I play today since I'm still not feeling the greatest. But I wanted to do some streaming and check out all the new stuff. Get right back in seventh week. All right. Let's do new game. We're gonna put it in slot ten so I don't lose track of it. Who shall I employ to run and manage my new zoo? Pick your appearance, you can change this later. Uh, all of them look the same to me, pretty much. We'll pick this one. Please enter a name for your zoo. Genesis Zoo. Alright. Kathleen, new task, visit the management office. Hey there, my name is Kathleen and I'm currently your zoo sale investor. Oh, zoo sole investor, not sale investor. Could you come down to the management office for a quick chat, please? Okay. All right, all kinds of requests end up here and I know you will want to keep on top of them. Try viewing a new task now. Build an enclosure. Okay. Every zoo needs animals, but before you can take a delivery of any animal, you need to build an enclosure. Task completed for this person. One out of 12. So, have our build tool here. We're gonna make a grass enclosure. These are all new. And then you put the door. Well, welcome back, Shadow. Okay, so let's see here. One, two, three. I know we need big enclosures because some of the animals breeding gets out of control. So let's see here, if I put... Let's see, that's the one, two, three, four, five. Uh, Uh, one, 
two, three, four, five. Is that big enough? I think I'll put the storeroom down below here. Alright, now that we have an enclosure, we can start the real business of finding animals to make our zoo one step closer to becoming the best zoo on planet Earth. I have a gift for you. Visit me at my zoo and I can tell you all about it. Just find the Australian Zoo on the world map. So we'll go up to the world map. Down to Australia. Hurry, you have made an enclosure to beat the game. <laughs> truth, we had an unexpected boost to our rabbit population last month that we just don't know what to do with them. I heard you were starting a new zoo and instantly thought we might um, have found the perfect home for a couple of our floppy-eared furballs. What do you say? Sure. So we're getting two rabbits. Turn to zoo. We're gonna put them in their enclosure. Uh, two animals. Six out of seventy-seven. Mm, complete four trades with the Cuba Zoo. This person will have a new task after I complete four trades. It's probably time to start trying to earn a living. Let's open the zoo so paying customers can start turning up. And our rabbits are here. Pick up. <laughs> I'm gonna change the look of our entrance here. It has four different looks. You can get this one, this one, and this one. And I think I'm gonna do the deer. I think the deer's cute. Okay, so we're gonna open up the zoo. This person will have a new task after one business day. Horizon Herald, grand opening. The mayor officially opened our new zoo today. The zoo has, that has been named Genesis Zoo was made possible through an investment from Kathleen Kay, a renowned international business mogul. The management of the zoo said we hope to become a huge success, bringing joy to animal lovers everywhere while also being financially responsible to our investors, maybe even buying them out and gaining our own independence one day. All right. You have a pen that does not have any water supply. Build some water basins for your animals. Okay. So watering is up there. I'm gonna move this to down. Move it here. No. I meant to have one more row around this exhibit so I could do grass, but that's okay. We'll just leave it here. So we need to get some water for the pen. Oh, research grant. I represent the Zoological Foundation for Research. I'm here to offer you a grant. If you build a research hub before the end of the day, I will fund you for the next 14 days. Okay, I'm not reading all that. <laughs> They're just talking about the draft for the research hub. There. Have some water. And get them a ball. Get them too. They have something to play with. this we're going to move actually i want to change the appearance first 
I like this one. Uh, yeah, this one. I'm gonna move it uh, down here. Research building. So we're gonna get $250 per day for 14 days. And we have to hire a worker. So, his politeness is terrible, but he's got great worth ethic. Let's bump this up a little bit, see if we can get him a little bit more polite. Looks like everybody left for the day already. Oops, didn't mean to pause the game. gonna do three wide but I might do one layer of grass. Let's see here. Nope. So we have a negative profit for the day but we attracted 24 people. Three people couldn't fit on buses and 21 entered the zoo. Now that we are finally up and running, I would love to start tracking your progress. If you reach to 25 total customers, I will be able to give you a small performance bonus. Uh, hi there, I can't believe a zoo has opened up here in town. I have a small observation though. Perhaps you might want to feed your animals. Hunger leads to starvation, and starvation leads to death, and I don't want dead animals stinking up the neighborhood. Build a storeroom for food. Okay. We'll get to that here in a second. Whoops. Oops. Okay, so we need the storeroom. Put it here on the other side. really close together for everything. So we'll just put it here. Wow, your worth it. That is terrible. On time again. <laughs> Welcome in, Elite. Yes, better timing than the last time. This guy's work ethic is horrendous. the 25 visitors and build the storeroom. So we got $100 for the storeroom. 
your zoo is going to become a rat infested den of disgust unless you hire someone to tidy it up. Hire a janitor from the ticket office. Okay, okay. And then we'll finish this task. $1,500 for that one. Park staff searching for a janitor. Uh, recruit. I'm gonna try the job portal, see if we can't get somebody good. Let's get some more pathways in here. How am I? I'm doing alright. I'm still sick though, but I'm working through it. What do you want, cat? Do I like scary games? Not particularly. The only one I've got is Dead by Daylight. And that one's not really scary after a while. I was terrified at first. <laughs> Boo. Uh, I actually need to change the animal diet here. Change animal diet. We want them to have a healthy diet. Right now their nutrition is terrible. So we want to get some of this going on. Okay. So 30 sick greens. Twenty percent there. Ten percent grass. There you go, satisfied. All right, so we got a better diet for him. Forty percent straw, thirty percent greens, twenty percent carrots, and ten percent grass. And let's order the food. Make sure we've got enough. Alright, we made $1,700 today. Uh, since I invested in this business, you have various performance targets to hit in order to unlock more capital. Reach 100 total customers and I will release some additional funding. And we need to get five animals for Animal Picture Club. We have unspent research points. Let's check for our applicants. We've got two so far. How do I check them again? Used to be able to see how good they were. Lost puppy. The animal keeper told me that we have found a lost dog, a beautiful Labrador. We could try to find its owner or we can use this as an opportunity to earn more money and expand the fledgling zoo. Why don't we dress the dog up as a lion and use it as to amaze your visitors? So this is where there's morality in the game. You can choose to dress it up and get bad morale or you can spend the money to advertise to find the owner to get good morale. And depending on your choices is what buildings you have unlocked. So I'm going to go ahead and go with the good morale because that's just me. So we're going to try and find its owner. So this is what your choices matter. The morality choices you make will impact the buildings and actions you can use and may be reflected in certain people's behavior. Choose wisely. Okay. Go ahead and hire this person. Um, would you like to close this position? Oh, yes. Okay. So we hired the janitor. Got another task. 
completed the task. And that gave us $200. Okay. But kitty, why are you whining? Oh, what? Okay, so let's get some pathways here. Think we should do the three wide or leave it a two wide? Three wide looks kind of big. Oh yeah, I need to do my research hub stuff. The research hub. How about a double wide? Okay. So this is the research screen. The employees of your research hub work tirelessly to earn points that you can use to unlock new buildings and bonuses. Try unlocking some research now. So we get this huge uh, research tree. It doesn't look that much right now since there's only four options, but as you unlock more, more options become available. So let's just go ahead and unlock all of these real quick. So you see we unlock that one and more options become available. Previews for important buildings and bonuses allow you to work towards unlocking the items you want. Selecting the research sets on the left gives you a hint about the locations of different things. Remember to come back regularly to spend your research points. So I kind of want the nursery. Um, but we can't get it just yet. Grab all of these. These are all one point each. With the desert enclosure. So the nursery is five points, so we'll come back for that. We do want to get the trampoline, because it's another research uh, another enrichment item for the animals. So we'll be back. So if we do a double wide, I want to do grass around this outer edge to kind of give a buffer. Willow, what are you doing, honey? Man. There's a double wide. Yeah, putting concrete and grass on top of people. <laughs> yeah, the double wide looks all right. I'm gonna put dirt here for now. And then I'm going to move this over to the grass. Milo, what are you doing? You're just trying to cause problems right now, honey. Alright, what is this? Uh, we did the research item. Oh my god, cat. Game says at the end of every calendar day, we lost money today. That's okay. We got $100. Oh, we got a new animal for trade. Uh, this person will have a new task after we unlock one research bag. So we have a baby bunny now. Just 
so who is who is this? E. I want to click on the buddy. We have Shaggy and Bambi, and they made Goose. <laughs> Goose the rabbit. What? Willow wants to be part of the zoo. Yes, she does. Throw her in there with the rabbits. Yeah, I will. Stop moving everywhere. Okay, let's get some nature in here. Get some trees. Put that right on top of that person. <laughs> Let's get a couple benches. shop to start earning revenue from your visitors. Okay. Shops. We've got cola vendor, snack vendor, gift stand, and hot dog shop. You're gonna fall off. What should we put in first? Hot dog shop or guest stand? <laughs> oh my god. She finally left. Um, yeah, after knocking all over the cans, yeah. She is stretched out. Okay, let's, let's put a hot dog stand here next to the storeroom. And we'll hire an employee. And we'll put a cola vendor right here next to it. So they have something to drink. <laughs> All right. Um, so we have a new trade variant, which is the brown bunny. So if we go to the world map, we can check here. This is the animal shelter. Oh, they've got new rabbits. So this is where you can adopt animals um, and put them in your zoo and it'll just tell you if they're new or not. So we're going to rescue this bunny here and put it in our zoo because it's a new variant. Okay, we lost money, but that's okay. So if we... new shelter animal. Ooh, there's a piggy in the shelter. Okay. So if we look, um, does it show it anywhere here? Species info. So you can see here there's one, two, or two, four, six, eight, ten variants of rabbits we can get uh, to unlock by breeding or through the animal shelter. And then once we unlock all of them, we can use them to, um, use their genome in the CRISPR splicer. There is a VIP in your zoo. Occasionally VIPs will visit your zoo. You will be able to interact with them by locating them and speaking to them. 
Oh. Are you the VIP? No, you're a black market dealer. They have a giraffe owl. Too expensive for us, though. We're gonna report this person. Say no to the animal trader. Who is our VIP person? You are a VIP person? No. Oh, we need to put down some bins. Bench. Facilities. Amenities. There we go. Let's put down a bin here. In here. And put one there. So we got 11 points here. Let's go ahead and unlock the trampoline. Shelter pack. And the nursery. I do want to get the nursery at some point. Because that'll speed up the breeding process. Hello, I'm here for the VIP position. <laughs> you got the VIP shadow. So let's go back to the world map and see what we've got here. So we have that pig that we could get. We have a male version of the new rabbit genome. Uh, I'm gonna rescue both of these. Yeah. Put them in here. And we need to put in uh, add objects. There we go. Enrichment. We want to get them an awesome trampoline. There they go. Jumping on the trampoline. What is this? Gift shop. They want a gift shop now. We could decorate the, the pen, but it does take up space. We'll put a fern in here and a small rock. There. did make a profit that day. Two people felt the ticket price was too expensive. We're gonna get more stuff coming in here. Create work zones. Your animal keepers are inefficient, making your animals suffer. Create work zones for better efficiency by selecting each keeper and deciding them places to work. Maximize efficiency by sending more experienced keepers to enclosures that are larger and further from the storeroom. Use the heat map view to review your zoning. Um, but I already assigned a keeper. They're just terrible at their job. So what if I should try and hire a better animal keeper? Oh, 
Um, international business trips on the rise. Okay. So we're getting international visitors now. Yeah, your work ethic is terrible. Let's see if we can't hire a different animal keeper. Yeah, I know. Everybody's grossed out because of all the poo. Those are animal keepers. Got terrible work ethic. Let's get... We're just gonna put it here real quick. We can always move it. Ooh, they got great work ethic. Let's increase their politeness. are inbound. extend our warmest welcome to you. The people of the city love having a zoo here and I have personally cleared the land around the zoo for development. If you want to buy more land to expand, we are happy to sell it to you. Buy land. Alrighty. We got $100 for that. And Mayor approves expansion plans. So we can buy more land now. But let's fix the pig's diet. Visitors finally. We got $1,500 for that. So we just need to buy land now. Debating which side I want to buy first. Bunch of money that day. I uh, think you know, opening a transport dealership to sell industrial vehicles and buses. If you would like to invest a sum of money, I'll open an account for you and ensure you are front of the queue when it comes to buying buses to service your zoo. Donate $500. Ooh, we got the money, sure. This person will have a new task after 40 has passed since previous quest was completed. Reward unlocked buying buses at ticket office. Okay. 
New business. So we can get more buses now. Let's see what we can get with our research points here. I'm gonna grab the nursery. Plant pack. That's a bad morality. Wind turbine. the big tree pack. Okay. And how much money is this? Three hundred dollars? Yeah. There we go. So we got more space now. I got a thousand dollars for that. We have no tasks right now. We do still have this. If we give them our little brown bunny, we'll get some geese. Or... No, we don't need any of those rabbits. No. So let's... Another enclosure here. Um, I'm not sure how big that other one is. This one looks pretty big though. around it. don't like the price. You can get over it. I haven't changed the price. It's five dollars. Take it or leave it. Um, park staff. I got five applicants here. Got Shelby here. It's terrible work ethic. There we go. Not so good on politeness. We don't really need to worry about politeness for an animal keeper. So, where is our other animal keeper? You. Fire. Zone you for this one. Okay.
let that keep running because we're going to need another zookeeper for this one. Objects. We put in some water, or we can see the end of the week. Taking out all of our money. We still have a decent amount, though. Okay. Fifty visitors in one day. Unlock energy pack wind turbine. And buy a bus. Goodness gracious, we got all kinds of tasks. Enrichment. Get some little balls in here. And another trampoline. No shelters yet? No. World map. Let's check the shelter. We have another pig. Let's get a second pig. I forgot to check what gender ours was. Okay, so yeah, we'll have a male and female. Oh, we had a little baby bunny! Look at him! He's so tiny! <laughs> little baby bunny named Alexis. Okay. So let's go ahead and get the geese. So you may have heard that a goose can be quite uh, difficult. Well, let me tell you. That most certainly is not the case, and is in no way the reason we are trying to trade a pair of them for just one rabbit. No, not at all. We just have our one brown bunny. Let's go ahead and trade them. We got two geese. We're gonna put our geese in here. Let's get this one. Yeah, we'll get, we'll get him. Or her. And we'll close the position for now. So you. Zone. Okay. We don't have a restroom. Do we have amenities? There we go. Restroom. No, oh, put the restroom there. For now. You can always change it later.
Oh, we have another baby bunny. Little white one. We may need to get another brown bunny. Got one here. Let's go ahead and grab her. Dude's doing pretty good. We got seven here, so we can buy the winter by now. No? Do I not have the morality for it? Where's my morality at? No, I do. Hmm. Interesting. Let's get some benches. Build a restroom, we did that. Buy a bus. Uh, order more. Two thousand dollars. Well, we get a thousand dollars back for it, though, at least. So. so we have two buses now. Got our geese coming in. So we need to change their diet. Twenty percent. Everybody's good to go. For now, I think we're gonna move the piggies over here so there's not as much space used.
I don't know if I have influence zones yet. Um, I forgot how to do this. Build three benches, did that. Where am I zoning? Which is the next land? Thousand? Not yet. Zone. Did I buy this yet? Yeah. There we go. Arch balls. Uh, crop seeds. Cabbage. Mini fountains. Incinerator. You know we're gonna need the incinerator at some point. Let's get the bushes. We've got a fire inside our soul. Hey, don't go out. We're beautiful people. Uh, oh, Zoo goes off the grid. Yeah, we just have to buy wind turbines here soon. Facilities, nursery. It's going to set it here temporarily. Oh, look at their work ethic. Fantastic. We could do this pair and just try to get a new bunny. Let's try that. Let's try breeding our geese. And let's check here, see if there's anything new. Nope. This one wants something for some snakes. This one wants something for some ducks. And it looks like a snake for some hyenas. And a snake for some pigs. So, got a little bit of ways to go. Squeal. 
think we're gonna get shelter. Did I unlock the shelters? No. I keep thinking I unlock the shelters, but when I grab something different. Hmm. A pretty fountain here. Let's see if we can put that somewhere eventually. There's a map. next to it. Two pregnancies going, they'll be done in two days. Jumpy, jumpy rabbits. Another pig, but we don't need another pig. We'll just hold off. What are you doing all the way up here? Oh, you're the breeder. What are you doing away from the babies? I'm trying to remember how to zone, and I can't remember to show where the um, janitor should work and everything. Um, let's 
some more bins. There we go. Another baby bunny. So cute. Got the trash people picking up trash. Just kind of at a standstill at the moment. Looks like we need to get a special goose maybe for these snakes. Shout out, looks like it made you the most recent subscriber. You just didn't get the notification for some reason. Another baby bunny. We have two baby bunnies. How are these looking? Got one day on pregnancies. Anything else we should add right now? Got 
get 25 animals. Goodness gracious. Own at least four minibus on route to Rise of Village. Get some wind turbines going. Oh, new shelter animal. There's a new goose. So let's look at the world map. Let's get this goose. Got 13 research points. Let's get shelters finally. For when that is inevitably needed. <laughs> oh god, how can something so cute taste so great? Run, piggies, run! Had a little brown bunny. Bummer. Almost there on the geese. Looks like we had, yeah, just a regular goose. We need to clean up some of these guys' animals. We might need that release hub.
Uh oh, the mighty gorilla's no more. The last gorilla passed away, making them extinct in the wild. Maybe we'll get gorillas one day. been a major fire in the forest nearby. We really need your help. Can you donate to us so we can rescue as many animals as possible? One more thing, you will need to look after them too. Um, yeah. Got a couple capybara coming in. Build the wind turbine did that one. We're gonna need to build another enclosure. smaller pin for now. We could always make it bigger.
end of the week. Losing a bunch of money. Okay. Getting the splicer. We at the Monsanto Corporation want to donate the plants for a CRISPR splicer. Since the discovery of CRISPR, it is possible for you to create animals by literally editing their DNA. Want a hypodile or a pig monkey? If you map the genome of an animal by finding or breeding at least five variants of any animal type, you can create your own animals. to get a crisper splicer at some point here. Got our new goose. Bitsy, yeah, itsy bitsy had to go. We can't get too many of the big boys in there or we're gonna run out of space. They're almost done nursing. We need to get the release hub. 13 points. Okay. It's a new day, so let's check the adoption center. Oh, we have a new capybara and a new goose. And decide which one to put in the smaller pen for now. Probably the geese, but the geese start to breed out of control. Maybe I'll put the pigs over there. Alright, you applicants. Capybara's animal diet too. There we go. So 
Let's order food. Bunnies are back out. Build the crisper splicer. try for this one. We're not going to make a peacock. No, 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 no. Um. We need this tradable variant here. Try them again. You <laughs> to up the ticket price a little bit. Low water. It's because we have too many bunnies. Crisper Splicer. Uh, we're gonna be moving all this stuff around later, but oh my god, this work ethic. It's not gonna do anything to change his work ethic. Mm -hmm. 
built by food shops. New shelter animal variant. Okay. Got a new goose. One is done. Map one genome by getting all ten animal variants. Oh my goodness. It's gonna be a minute. We had 50 visitors in one day. Nice. 100 for that. Try for a new capybara breeding pair. Oh, animal's already pregnant. Well, shoot. Well, we'll see what she has. We can try for this one. Hub now. Nice. Mountain enclosure. We'll save for the incinerator next. Another baby bunny. Wants us to buy another bus, I think. I still can't stop sweating because I'm freaking sick. 
uh, I haven't said that enough already, so. We get our new goose in today, though, when we come back. Oh, we got five of the um, beast genomes. That's awesome. So we'll get that one in for next time. If you did enjoy the stream, make sure to comment below if you want to see more Let's Build a Zoo. And make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys next time. Bye! Thank you.